we are all, in a sense, doomed. What are you talking about? Downward social mobility. I'm, we hear a lot about the great social mobility in America, with the focus usually on the, on the comparative ease of moving upwards. What's less discussed is how easy it is to, to go down. I think that's the, the direction that we're all heading in. And, and I think that the downward fall is going to be very fast, not, not just for us as, as individuals, but the whole preppy class. Where do you get all this? Well, just look around. I mean, take those of our fathers who grew up very well off. I mean, maybe their, their career started out well enough, but, but just as their contemporaries really began to accomplish things, they, they started to quit. I'm um, rising above office politics, or, or refusing to compete and risk open failure, or, or not, not doing the humdrum part of the job, or only doing the humdrum part, or gradually spending more and more time on something more interesting, um, conservation or the arts, where even if they were total failures, no one would know it. Okay. I guess we all know who you're talking about. I can't deny your point, but unlike you, I've always assumed I'd be a failure anyway. That's why I plan to marry an extremely rich woman. Pretty depressing. A bit overstated, don't you think? Oh, I'm not so sure. Dude, even if you were right, it wouldn't be any great tragedy if some of these people lost their class prerogatives. These people are everyone I know. And besides, it's not a question of losing class prerogatives, whatever that means. But the prospect of wasting your whole productive life, of personal failure. That's so melodramatic. Life is melodramatic if you look at the whole sweep of it. I don't know. I think my father considers himself a failure. Although I don't think he's one. I guess few people's lives match their own expectations. <laughs>